In this instructional video, we will demonstrate how to collect mold spores in the air using a pump and a cassette. Before starting, ensure that all doors and windows in the area you wish to test are closed and remain closed for at least 24 hours before sampling. Be sure that there is no construction activity in the area on the day of the sampling and that any house plants are removed from the area of the test before starting. Begin by opening your mold analysis kit. When you order a test kit from LCS Laboratory, we will send you one air sampling pump, one or more cassettes, written instructions on how to perform the test, and a test request form. Begin by placing your pump four to five feet from the ground. A table, shelf, desk, or any other elevated surface from the ground will work. Next, plug the pump into an outlet. The high volume pump requires a standard AC 110 volt wall plug, so be sure that you have one nearby in the area that the samples will be collected. Remove one of the mold sampling cassettes from the provided bag. Each cassette has two holes which are covered with protective tape. Removing the protective tape from either end of the mold sampling cassette will reveal a rectangular hole and a circular hole. To load a cassette onto the pump, first press the release hatch on the front of the pump to reveal the pump inlet. Next, reveal the circular hole of the cassette by peeling off the protective tape and attach it directly onto the pump inlet. Then, carefully remove the protective tape to reveal the rectangular hole completely. The airflow directional arrow on the cassette should be pointing towards the bottom of the pump. Press the green circle on the pump to turn the pump on. You will audibly hear the pump start up. The pump will turn off automatically after 5 minutes. Unplug the pump and remove the cassette. Use the protective tape to seal both the holes of the cassette. Close the lid of the pump when you are finished. Next, you will need your cassette, a mold test form, a sharpie or marker, and a pen. Label your cassette with the location you collected the sample and the number of the sample. Once all cassettes are labeled, begin filling out the test request form. Make sure to include your name, phone number, email, and a project number if applicable. Next, in the sample description area, Put the information for each cassette you used for sampling and answer the questions in the table. Choose a turnaround time for your samples and sign and date the form. Place all your cassettes and the filled out test request forms into a plastic bag. Now place everything back into the sample test kit. You can return the sample test kit back to us by mail or by using our Dropbox. Once we receive the sample testing kit with your samples, we will begin the analysis for you.